Hello everyone, and welcome to Power Pages Tips. My name is Nicholas Heyduk, and this is tip number 223, list displayed with map. Normally when you create a list in Power Pages, you see a table with columns based on the view that you've defined. But there are other ways to display your data. In this tip, I'll look at how you can display your data with a map interface. Enabling the map functionality is done via the portal management app. Open your list and go to the map view tab. First, check the map enabled checkbox. Then you need to tell Power Pages which fields from your table to use to create the map. This includes the latitude and longitude fields. These must be floating point number columns. You also pick which fields to use as the title and description. In the settings area, the first thing you need to fill out is the credentials field. This is your Bing Maps API key, which you can get by going to bingmapsportal.com. This section also allows you to set the default center for the map, the default zoom level, offset for the info box, and pin size and image URL. Finally, the search options let you choose to use either miles or kilometers, and the comma-separated lists of distance values that show up in the drop-down. With those settings in place, when you view the list, you'll see a map instead of the table. You then enter an address and a search radius, and click the search button. You then see any results that are within the radius, listed to the right of the map. For any results, you can click the Get Directions button, to get turn-by-turn -turn directions to the selected location. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Pages tip number 223 on lists displayed with map useful.